Stager to the stars. So when celebrities are buying or selling their lavish properties, they turn to one sought after interior designer and staging guru, Cheryl Eisen. And today she's got some celebrity real estate, style, and scoop for us. All you need to do is make it sexy. And that's exactly what she does. From Chrissy and John Legend's lair to Robert De Niro's mucho De Niro loft. I grew up in a tough neighborhood. Celebrity stager Cheryl Eisen's eye for design has sold big time properties worldwide in the blink of an eye. I sold my apartment in one day. Oh my God, I'm so happy. Her latest belonging to a very famous Real Housewife of New York, Bethany Frankel. Yay! I love working with Bethany. She's got a lot of properties and a lot of opinions. Home I don't play that. Worked on her Hamptons house, on her Soho house, and the Tribeca one, of course, which sold in a day. It was 4,000 square feet, sold for full ass, 6.9 million. Walk me through it. So this is before, then it was, you know, beautiful, but it was her specific taste. Furniture's a little high, makes the ceilings look low. Okay. We made this furniture low, ceilings look higher. Yeah, I mean, great flow, great floors. It just really looks so much bigger. Here in the master bedroom, she had very very taste specific wallpaper. Okay. Now you can't always get rid of it and you can't paint over it. What do you do? You cover it as much as possible. We put mirrors, we put a custom headboard. We neutralized it when we could. Cheryl's also helped style and sell Keith Richards' rock and roll penthouse. Oversized art is essential. So it doesn't have to be art, it doesn't have to be paintings. It can also just be words. We've created this piece of art. It actually says the word high art and we made it into high art. And the home sold for high money. The music legends laughing <laughs> all the way to the bank. All right, well, your high design staging that hasn't just attracted celebrity sellers, but also celebrity buyers, including my personal favorite, Daniel Craig. Million Dollar Listing New York's Frederick Eklund was showing a dark loft with little interest. I came in and I said, listen, this needs to be sexy and like a bachelor pad, like a mm. James Bond kind of a feel. Totally. Did it, and then he, Frederick Eklund. He called me and said, you're never gonna guess who bought this place. James Bond. James Bond himself. All cash, full ass. Every penny of it. Cheryl has a great tip for anyone who wants to spruce up their space. She says lighting changes everything. It not only makes your home brighter, but also adds character. So make it a statement piece and you can't go wrong.